Hello guys, I'm Tim with the Earl Earl Sports Bets and Picks and Parlays, and welcome back to another edition of Balling Out with Tim Earl. We've got some college basketball for you guys. Uh, we'll be talking over Houston, Iowa State, Texas and Cincinnati, Duke, Pittsburgh, and then some Colorado State, Boise State action. Before we jump into it, um, looking at this year so far, eight days of of, day, uh, of plays, um, and we're six and two in terms of profitable days. So uh, having a good year to start off. If you guys are interested in hopping on, picksandparlays.net forward slash Tim. It's where you can get a one-week pass, $70. And uh, I think as we're currently sitting throughout the start of 2024, we are profitable in every single sport at the moment. We'll see how the rest of the year goes. Once again, right there. Also, if you guys are interested, make sure you guys are following Earl Sports Bets on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter. Let's jump into it. We'll start off with Houston and Iowa State. Houston is the number two team in the nation. Three and a half point favorites in this one. Total of 131 and a half. And I think it's just too close of a spread. You get uh, Houston on their second road game of the year. They did win that road game. They did not cover when they played in Xavier. Um, other than that, they've just been constantly playing home games. And I think that's going to backfire against them because you got an Iowa State team that is 9-0 at home, 7-1-1 one one against the spread at home. I think this is an Iowa State spot. Give me, uh, give me the Cyclones plus the three and a half to start it out. Let's go over to Texas and Cincinnati. Um, you get Cincinnati as a four-point favorite with a total of 146 and a half in this one. Same kind of deal. You get Cincinnati, who is undefeated um, on the, uh, at home this year. You got Texas, who is 0-1 on the road. They played one road game. It was in Marquette, and they lost by 21. Um not only that, we get a ranked versus unranked matchup, and the unranked team is favorited. Sign me up for Cincinnati. Minus the four in this one. Just a spot that I'm going to keep riding my system play. Uh, it's been decent so far this year. Cincinnati minus the four. Let's jump over to Duke and Pittsburgh. Uh, ACC action. Duke minus five and a half with a total of 145 and a half. Once again, this is not a Duke team that I trust, especially on the road. They are 1-2 and two on the road, 0-3 oh against the spread. They've played 11 games at home, three games on the road. Um, and the games on the, ro- on the road, obviously, you had some tough games. Arkansas, tough game on the road. Georgia Tech, you're losing as a 12.5 point favorite to Georgia Tech on the road. And then they did beat Notre Dame, but they did not cover the spread. I don't think they cover the spread here. Give me Pittsburgh plus the 5.5. Let's finish this out with Colorado State and Boise State. Um, Colorado State's a one and a half, 145 and a half is the total. Same kind of deal. Um, this is a Colorado State team that is number 17 in the country. Boise State, they're not ranked. And it's this close of a spread. Sign me up for Boise State in this one. You can get their money line around even money. We actually have them closer to a three, three and a half point favorite. So uh, I do like Boise State in this game. We'll grab them even money versus Colorado State. Those are the four free picks for college basketball for tomorrow. Um, I'm I'm sure that the Colorado State or the Boise State play will be up on the site. I'm not sure about the other three. Uh, those are kind of my system plays. Um, we'll see whether or not we have true value on them. Um, and then, well, you'll know if they're on the site, they are official play. But those are some free plays for tomorrow. Once again, all of the best bets right there. And make sure you guys are following us on all socials. Iowa State plus the three and a half. Cincy minus four. Pittsburgh plus five and a half. And we'll finish it out with Boise State. That's going to do it for this edition of Bono tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching.